Hey guys, it's Alex here with Northern Scavenger. Every once in a while, I get asked why I like going on canoe trips. And I've probably given over a hundred different answers to this question over the years. As difficult of a question as it is for me to answer, I like being asked it because it makes me think of all the great memories I have from past trips. See, for me, canoe trips have taken me places that I would have never imagined I would have ever gone. It all started from the days when we, because I'm gonna include Noah in this, had no idea what we were doing. I was wearing clothes out of a box of beer and we were paddling and carrying the heaviest canoe you could possibly imagine. But we made do with the equipment that we had available. Over the years, we've learned a lot and we are a lot more confident going on bigger and more exciting adventures. Outside of all the things I've learned and the places I've been, each trip comes with a handful of other individual experiences that keeps me coming back. Like waking up to the perfect sunrise or ending the day with the perfect sunset, paddling a remote river that few have ever traveled, scouting a line and then finding a way to run it perfectly, searching for fish or hooking into a new personal best, incredible wildlife encounters, the crackle of a campfire, lying down and staring at the stars, connecting to the land and appreciating the vessel that represents so much of Canada. It isn't always easy on canoe trips, but what many people don't appreciate is the feeling of accomplishment that comes when you push through the tough times, like the rain, the bugs, and the cold temperatures. It doesn't always need to be tough, for me, it can be as simple as leaving my day-to-day -day worries behind and focusing on the task at hand. The simplicity of it all, the crisp air, the cool water, maybe a fresh cup of coffee. Some people like to experience it alone. Others, like myself, like to share these moments with friends. Either way, these experiences that you have on a canoe trip create memories that will last you a lifetime. We are going through some challenging times right now, and with the canoe tripping season coming to a close, I urge you to try to get on at least one more adventure this year. If that isn't possible for you, maybe just spend a few minutes thinking about why you love canoe tripping. I think I've decided that at the end of the day, I don't really care what the reason is, I just know I wanna go on another canoe trip. <laughs>